a very good morning from St Lucia. Thank you for joining me on my latest adventure. This is quite a special one. teddy bear. I'm here with my mummy, this is her teddy bear. Um, thank you for joining me on my latest adventure. I'm here in St Lucia at the one and only Jade Mountain Resort. My goodness, is this place amazing. And I'm so lucky that I get to be here with my mummy as well. So I'm going to kick straight off with a room tour because this hotel is all about the rooms. Check it out. Brace yourself. It's incredible. You walk straight into the room full poster bed with stunning mosquito nets and then you walk down the stairs to the most incredible view you've ever seen of the classic pitons here in St Lucia. Then you walk around and you've got the hot tub which is amazing, I mean the view from the hot tub, what? And then you walk around to the bathroom which is huge and all completely open air and the best thing is that the bathroom, all of the mirrors lead out to the view of the pitons. So even when you're having a shower or going for a wee, you get to see the amazing view. I absolutely love this hotel. So yeah, as I said, here with my mummy, who is at the moment watching my latest YouTube video, which I've just published today, which is of Sweden, Swedish Lapland, Husky sledding, ice hotel. I personally loved it. So if you haven't seen that video and you fancy a little snowy adventure, check it out. It will be somewhere in YouTube land on my feed. I'm not very good at YouTube, as you probably know. But I do now have a thousand subscribers, which is amazing. The CNC crew is a thousand strong. Thank you so much for everyone that subscribed to my channel. I started YouTube just to make my blogs come to life. Um, I write a luxury travel blog called Clutch and Carry On for those of you that don't already know. It's linked in the description box down below. And all of the details of this trip will be on the blog as well. So yeah, I started to kind of just go along with my blog and bring places to life. But a thousand, that's mega. I know in today's day and age, especially when it comes to social media, people might not see a thousand as a lot, but it means everything to me that I have a thousand people watching all of these videos. And yeah, thank you so much. If you're one of those thousand that click the subscribe button and for anyone that ever likes any of my videos, that also means so much to me. So thank you so much. <laughs> I know it doesn't mean a lot to most, but it means everything to me, so thank you. And uh, if you're new to the channel, welcome to the crew. It's really pretty and it's quite nice and quiet, even though all beaches in St Lucia um, are public. It's only really hotel guests that are here on this beach because it's quite difficult to get to. It's in a cove. So the beds are really nice plush mattresses and someone lays out a towel for you when you get your bed. And then you also get a flag that you can put in the sand if you want drink or snacks or anything like that. Um, someone just comes over for your flags in the sand and takes your order and then brings it to you, which is just, yeah. Um, so we're going to be going on quite a few boat trips while we're here. We want to spend most of the time in our room, but we thought we'd check the beach out, and I'm so glad we did because the view I have right now is just amazing. That is the shuttle bus, by the way, <laughs> because obviously Jade Mountain's really high, so if you don't want to walk down all of the stairs to come to the beach, you can jump on the shuttle bus, which I think is just on demand. You get given a little mobile phone. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this, you get a butler. Um, so yeah, you get given a little mobile phone, and then you just call your butler whenever you want to go back up, and they arrange the shuttle for you. Pretty cool.
Um, you know how we thought our last room was paradise? We didn't even know a place like this existed. We have just upgraded rooms to the Sunrise Water Villa Pool extravaganza rooms. I need to check the proper name for them, but right now I'm blown away. I've stayed in a room that's had a pool before, but this is a full on swimming pool. And with that view, this is gonna be unmatched by any, I think. It's absolutely stunning. This one has a little layout area as well, so you can sunbathe. Huge, big living area. Again, you've got all of your coffee machines. I say all of, you have a kettle, you have a coffee machine to put freshly ground coffee in, and then you also have an espresso machine. And then this is a fully stocked fridge of champers and wine. And then you've got the mini bar, just like in our last room. And what they've done is they've just transferred everything from our old mini bar, which is really cool. It's just amazing. It is as big as it looks. In fact, no, it's bigger than it looks in this film right now. It's so pretty. And then you go up the stairs to the bathroom in this room. Took me a while to find the shower because the shower's just completely open look, which actually when you're stood in a shower, that will be your view. So no complaints about it being open. And then you've got a big whirlpool bath once again. These things are so deep, they're amazing. View, 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 view. Sink area, myself. Hello, just fresh off the beach, so a little bit dishevelled, but I wanted to show you the room straight away. And then huge big mirrors, and of course the toilet. How mega is this? So, so, so over the moon. And the first thing we're gonna do is jump straight in the pool. Head underwater, falling back into you. I thought we'd be smarter. Got nothing left to lose. You said you fall with me. No matter how far it goes, down deep and under. We're stuck in this battle. So we've just got back to our room after our amazing sunset cruise and rather than putting all of the lovely little tea lights around the pool and the bath, we mentioned that we fancy staying in for dinner tonight and having room service. So they've set the table romantically for two. This hotel just thinks of everything. They go above and beyond. It's amazing. So my mummy is checking out the menu whilst just sat on the edge of the pool casually. Mm -hmm. This is amazing. Oh, yeah. What I will do, I will leave the, um, uh, the, the lap on the door so I can just enter. Okay. Thank you so Great. Much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Listen, 
I just went for a little nighttime swim in our pool and I'm a little bit gutted because Jade Mountain is definitely one of these places that you just can't capture on film and I wish that I was better and I wish that I had the most amazing camera ever because right at the end of our infinity pool right now you can see in the dusk lighting the two pitons and thousands of stars it's just it's amazing and I did try I tried to you know put the slowest shutter speed ever and capture the moment but it's just impossible but it's gonna go down as one of my best swims ever because this place is just insane and I just can't get over how big the pool is I was just doing laps in our pool whilst my mum is chilling in bed I mean how mental is that this is just you know chilling in bed after we've seen all those dolphins and I just went for a full lap swim in our private pool and gazed up at thousands of stars with the shadow of the pitons. Good morning. So after the most successful sunset cruise ever last night, oh my goodness, those dolphins jumping into the sunset was just insane. We are now going on an official dolphin and whale watching tour in a slightly different boat. Now we'd be pretty jammy if we saw them again, but fingers crossed all the same. They see all different types of whales out here in Ten Lucia, so um, they have the whale watching tour that goes out about twice a week. So yeah, fingers crossed. Falling back into you I thought we'd be smarter I got nothing left to lose You said you fall with me No matter how far it goes Now deep and under after the most amazing double sighting of dolphins after our boat trip this morning to see the whales, which was an official whale watching tour. We did see them, we saw some pilot whales, which we were over the moon about. My mama has the best luck when it comes to seeing mammals in the sea because she always sees them. So I'm gonna take her everywhere. Um, but we've been back for the entire afternoon. It was just a morning trip. We had some lunch in the room and then I actually took some photos in the pool. The butlers bought in a huge bag of petals for me. Um, I'm gonna insert a little bit now um, or the picture or some, somebody walking through the petals, something to show you how gorgeous these petals were because it was just amazing of them to do it. I'm just sat in the bed right now, but the view from this bed is just amazing. So this is the mosquito net. And then that's the huge big pool right there. That's what I was shooting actually. Some uh, Dior beauty products which I've been trying out, which I really love actually. It's the Capture the Youth collection. You basically get a cream, which is like an anti-aging moisturizing cream, and then you add in different pipettes of serum depending on how your skin's feeling on a particular day. Um, yeah, really like them. And I just took a picture um, for my Instagram, which I will insert right now if you haven't already seen it. The rest of the day, uh, we're just going to be staying inside our sanctuary. And I've just realised, actually, I might have said room a few times. It's not called a room. And they're very strict about it because whenever my mum and I talk about going back to our room, they always tell us off. Each room, um, each uh, space is called a sanctuary. So basically, rather than going back to your room, you go back to your sanctuary. So this sanctuary is JA6. This is the one um, that is designed for you to catch the sun. It's called the Sun sanctuary and it's because half of the pool is in the sun and also if there's a sunbathing area as well which we didn't have in our other room and we have been loving um, despite how ridiculously pale I am right now I have been in the sun all day and this is actually somewhat of a tan for me I start my holidays with fake tan on I get a fake fake spray tan every single holiday um, or every single trip abroad somewhere hot and then I end up leaving significantly paler than when I set out but it's cool, at least you know I'm protecting my skin. Back to 50 all the way. But yeah, we're just gonna order some room service tonight and watch the sunset from our haven.
So we just got our breakfast delivered to our room. They lay it out on the table. It's so sweet. I've got a gluten-free pancake. I've been good every single morning and just had fruit and yogurt, but for today I thought I'd just go crazy. So I've got a pancake. My mum's got some bread and a cheese plate. Granola. That's also mine. <laughs> Don't let it being in front of my mum fool you. So we just spent the last few hours at the beach. We've actually been moved into another room, which is at Anne's Chastenay. It's the most beautiful room. This is the highest grade that you can get in the sister hotel, which is technically a step down from Jade Mountain. But as we have a late flight, they've allowed us to use this room for the day. My mum's just in the shower. So we're gonna freshen up and then we're gonna get on the flight home. I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. I thoroughly enjoyed this trip. It was just exactly what both my mum and I needed. Complete relaxation, ultimate luxury, and some of the most amazing views I've seen in my entire life and I've seen a few so thank you so much for joining me on this adventure my next adventure is to the Maldives I'm actually flying home and then flying straight back out to the Maldives so if you haven't already subscribed I'd love it if you could join the CNC crew just click the subscribe button and check out some of my other videos if you haven't seen them otherwise I'll catch you in the Maldives